most people would show their Remy hair in. <laughs> anyway, stay tuned for what it may be Just for curious to know, I don't know what is so great about this Remy hair. Inquire minds want to know. This is actually my second time using this little bottle that you normally get for like five bucks. And now I'm all out, so my head's all covered. So. No problem with that. I was able to use it twice. close it up, simple invisible part. And um, according to the instructions for this hair, it says you're not supposed to, uh, if you're using hair glue, which I am, you're not supposed to bond it uh, with the hair dryer for heat tools. But I have that one to weave on so it's not sticking. So I don't use that. Um, but it did figure out dry. That said that. Oh like this hair better not burn out as much as it costs. I think I'm liking it. It's got a lot of balance to it. A few things that I want to try. Okay. All right. Okay. Right. Um, <laughs> here they are. The tracks are in there. Mm -hmm. I definitely have to style it some type of way. I'm told there's a lot of stuff you could do with the women here. Mm -hmm. so, finished product. <laughs> it's a lot of hair. Uh, I still have some hair left. A little bit. I was kind of worried I was going to ride in here. I'm going to figure out what to do with it. But it is an idea with the uh, flexi rise hair rollers. But um, I guess I'll get some heat to it first. And this is what it looks like with uh, no. Uh, I haven't sprayed anything on it. I mean, both my lights are on. Mm -hmm. I was trying to get some more light so y'all see, but... Let's see. The only thing I don't like is trying to get my clothes used to stay down and not look high. Like a, um... How do you describe it? It doesn't feel like I can only use the hair. Yeah, I have a ghetto tripod. <laughs> so, you can still reuse your old, the empty um, baby wipes. Other than that, I have no idea because my mirror is here. Anyhow, this is a 
what I've done with this ring here. And it's some pretty hair. I guess it's just depending on how you put it in. It's, um, and I haven't been one over styling it because this is the most stubborn hair I've ever seen. But so it's kind of like the doobie hair where it's set. You know how that doobie hair is bent and you can't really do nothing else with it. Really well. And I'm hoping that this is not the case for this hair. This is the, um, the one in the burgundy pack. Velvet women, and I never seen them so covered in my life. And I have on very high shade and cannot slip up right here, but I, the way I want it, so I may just have to take a trip. So I may mean, have to sit in the hair dryer or something. But I can have some tips, I guess, on how to style this hair. I just have to get ready to go, so. This is the only way I can wear it <laughs> with uh, all the clips in the back. Get it out of my face, so. <sighs> Man, this hair is just thin as it is. I don't deny that it is so pretty hair, but. I and mean, then I try to ride it with the flexi rods, and the hair is so shiny and slippery that it would not stay on the rods. I mean, I don't know. This is not human hair that I'm used to. So I may have to try to do the method. See what happens. Okay, she's not my friend today. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Mm. I'm seeing another thing. Another, another clip. I got to go and I'm going to keep pushing with this thing. So. Okay.